What up YouTube, it's your boy the Quick Brown Fox and today we have another unboxing video, this time a Japanese family box. So if you don't know what this is, this is actually a box to help you learn how to play the game, but this is obviously in Japanese so this wouldn't help uh, probably most of you probably wouldn't help me without some serious Google translating, AKA asking someone who knows Japanese because Google translate for Japanese is actual dog shit. So let's get into it. Oh, I don't wanna scratch the surface of this one. I actually think that you can keep this box afterwards. So I'm gonna try and not absolutely destroy this box come on oh and for those for those of you who actually know japanese you've probably already read the back of this and know what's going to happen but basically uh this is uh, yeah you get some cards you get some play mats, you get some tokens, you get stuff. It's a whole lot of fun. We're gonna open it up anyways. And it starts like this. You slide that off. You appreciate the awesome artwork, Pikachu and Charizard fighting. Gonna check around the science. This is a really cool pattern. Really cool background pattern. And yes, those were the sides. I believe this is a flap that you can open up like this and look at the presentation. Look at this, you open it up and immediately you get three awesome special alternate art cards. This is amazing. Let's take a look at these. These are actually the three decks for the game, I believe. So that's the first thing you get in the box. After that, there's another cardboard divider. Throw that on the floor promptly. Actually, I'm gonna keep that, so I uh, shouldn't, probably shouldn't have thrown it that hard. Uh, Pokemon card game wristbands, I guess. Uh, so you know which deck is yours. I guess you can like play for who gets which deck. Those. This is some promotional material for Unbroken Bonds or the Japanese version, uh, whatever that's called. I'm gonna put that on the screen because I can't remember right now. Tag team something. Uh, here are some guides for the different decks, I believe. One for the Raichu deck and one for the Mewtwo deck, but none for the Charizard deck, apparently. Screw those guys, I guess. And so, yes, this is a play mat. Sorry. This playmat is made out of the regular playmat paper, so it's. Uh, I'm probably not gonna touch this a lot because I don't wanna tarnish it and break it and ruin it. And uh, I wanna keep it kind of mint condition. This, I believe, is some of the rules, the rule sets for this. They talk about these guide thingies. Maybe Charizard is the advanced pack that you get to play without a guide. And here is some cardboard something, a divider of some sort. And we have a lot of counters. And this is really thick cardboard. Look at this. I believe this is the coin that you actually get to play with. So it's not, it's not actually a plastic coin or a metal coin in this. It's actually a cardboard coin. Which is kind of disappointing, but it's really cool. Look at Pikachu, he's a bad ass. Yes. I'm not gonna actually pop any of those out. I'm gonna put all of this I just pulled out of the box back neatly into the box. And then we're gonna take a look at the cards. So these I am actually gonna open. Um, and we've already been spoiled on the front card of this one. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna see if I can't give this a little bit of a, if I can't make this go my way a little bit easier than that. 
because I couldn't actually find the grip for this round thingy, this band thingy. There we go. So this deck, a Mewtwo GX, and immediately after, pretty cool, really cool, Gyarados GX. And right after that, that a uh, not so cool, but still pretty awesome Magikarp, Magikarp army, where you at? And then there's probably going to be a bunch of duplicates, but here's a Lapras playing with a ball. That's pretty cool. We've got Puku Muku puking out his innards. We've got Ekans looking at the... Double on the, way across the sky. Sorry for that cringe, and that's a dead meme, sorry. Uh, Jinx, Mew, looking all cuddly, non-hollow, but pretty cool. Marini, I believe this one is called, and this one I can't remember for my name. It's the Poison Boy. Uh, and here we got Farfetch'd, of course. I love me some Farfetch'd. Whenever I get the chance, I play with a Farfetch'd. Because they're damn cool, even though their stats are pretty subpar. Their moveset is pretty fun for a while. Snorlax sleeping in the shadow. A Banhammer. Some great balls. I believe these are um, now illegal. And uh, Pokeball. So if you get this set to learn how to play, um, I believe most of these cards are actually illegal to play within the set. But yeah, they're, they're great for collecting. Bunch of trainers, Cynthia, How, bunch of energy cards, Psyduck, How, energy cards. Galore, so you can actually play this set, and on the end, a Jinx. So that's a pretty cool deck, I think. I believe. So next deck is going to be the Raichu one. I actually haven't spoiled myself to as to what actually is contained in these uh, decks. So if you're also unspoiled to this, you're in for a ride. We're both in for a ride. And if you have already seen uh, an opening of this box, what are you doing here? You should probably watch someone uh, more famous or watch one of my other videos, uh, preferably. Thank you. So, Raichu. Regular old Raichu. None of that Alolan crap or anything. And Wigglytuff. Not as cool as Gyarados, I feel, but serviceable and a pikachu of course in the raichu deck and this artwork is so darn cute and cool voltorb getting experimented on i guess electrode just preparing to blow the fuck up and togedemaru clefairy clefable Jigglypuff, Mr. Mime, look at that artwork. What's he doing? Is he blocking hearts? Or is he making hearts? You never know with that little rascal, do you? Oh, I thought that was the trainer. Uh, yeah, um, Chansey. Eevee, Potion, Great Balls of Fire, Pokeball thingies. That guy, Cynthia, Hal, Nurse Joy, Pokemon Center, maybe uh, it's a Bug Catcher Boy, Energy, another Clefable, another Pikachu, Energy Galore, and on the end, it's a, another Clefairy. Cool set, Fairy and Lightning. Let's go Charizard deck. Come on. This is what we're here for. There we go. And. Oh, flip it around. It's Charizard, of course. Look at that boy. Look at him just blasting everything with fire around him. Oh, Pinsir GX. That's pretty cool. 
uh, that's a bit cooler than than Wiggly Tough, I feel. Uh, and also, not not as cool as Gyarados, though. But still pretty cool, pretty darn cool. KRP, are we gonna see a Butterfree, my main man? In this set. Metapod, and there we go. Butterfree, where are you? There he is. Come to me. Scyther, it's another cool dude. Oh, I couldn't actually see what that was before. Uh, yeah, this is the anchor Pokemon that I don't know, that I can't remember his name, sorry. About that, Charmander, my boy, Char Charmander! That was terrible, I'm sorry. Chameleon, Magmar, Slandit, or Salazzle maybe. Can't tell from that artwork, maybe Salazzle probably. Uh, th no, this is Salazzle, and this is probably Salandit. Kangaskhan, Great Balls of Fire, Rare Candies, Bunch of Trainers, Cynthia, How, Spudcatcher Boy, some Leaf Energy, Bunch of Unlisted Leaves, some Fire Energy, and, yeah, no, actually no Pokemon on the end. For this deck yeah that's a pretty cool set and all these cards obviously have the markings on them so you can tell which set you're playing when you're learning how to play and this with this box that's pretty cool yeah that was the end of this family in Japanese family box I'm just gonna sleeve these cards up and I'm gonna see you next video Bye.